Welcome back to Hit Points Gaming. Thank you for joining us. This is episode 21 of our Madara campaign. We are helping Patrick uh, find his sh lost shotgun in the deep, dark woods. We've been through uh, a pond and some cave sickles and thickets with Gavaudens. Mm -hmm. And now he has us deeper... I don't even and know. we're split up. I, That's what right. I'm very excited for in this episode. Oh, great. Team's going to be split. Going to go one of two different two different ways. Hopefully we meet up at a certain point. There's a lot of monsters already on the board. And it is random. Right. What I want to say is uh, this episode is being recorded before the last one uh, airs. airs. So any of you who happen to post um, any rules... Uh, clarification or answer. We didn't read it yet. So we didn't. We're just going straight in. We got to do a bunch of these at once um, to get in our vault. Mm hmm. Just in case. Just in case, you know, we become parents earlier than we think we will. Right. So. See, how, see how far we can get through because we want to get do this and do the same thing with our Kingdom Death campaign. Correct. So, so we're trying to bank a few. So. We will take any rule corrections in any video, and we'll just deal with them when, when we get to it. And I will have to say, uh, we have been watching some more Marble Olympics recently. Well, they're doing a side event. Yeah, I was going to say, they're not the Marble. It's not the Marble no, it's Olympics. Not the Mar right, right. It's like, it's an, like a summer, fall... Exhibition. Exhibition, yes. Yeah. Yeah, it's exciting, very relaxing. So um, in, after this video, you can go check that out. Yes, definitely enjoy it. So we are interrupting this episode right now uh, to inform you that, thanks to some of our viewers, you've pointed out that Madara has um, instituted some further updates than what we were aware of. Some. A, a lot a of updates. A lot of updates. Uh, and I just read them before we started taping our next episode. Uh, which we will be incorporating because I think you're, I think you're like two or three episodes behind when you're watching this. We're just starting the episode with the Abraxas dice that we're going to be we doing today. Be. Yes. Meaning after that episode, when we start our next main story event, we will be implementing all of the changes. Right. Now, why I'm very happy about this is because the difficulty of the game increases, which I thought you know from the very beginning. How are we going to be? Are we going to be fighting cave sickles with the, the same time? health? Maybe. How does that work? Now we just even Rook can one shot them, so I think it's a little too easy. Right. So I'm very pleased now with all the changes. I think after chapter one is when uh, stronger monsters come into play. So that's where we are now. We're in chapter two, which is mm -hmm. good. I think we did maybe one or two story missions and some side missions at this point. Uh, so I think that's fine. That's fine. It gives us some... There's going to be a challenge going forward, which is exactly what we want. We got, love a challenge. Like challenges, you guys watch. Like, I think you enjoy watching challenges rather than Rook just one-shotting things all the time. <laughs> so uh, it's going to take some time for us to, well, to, to go through the rules and then print everything. So Yeah, and get the ones aligned with our characters. And yeah. we still had some purchasing to do um, after the last mission. So, yeah, eventually we'll be caught up. Right, so you've got two more side missions to see, this one and the next week's, where it's still going to be easy mode. And a Braxis Dice Although episode. somebody doesn't make it. Uh, <laughs> you're, so, you're so silly. I'm not allowed to give spoilers. I didn't give a spoiler. Uh, no, you didn't, but after the well, side mission, then we're going to start the full rules after the Abraxas Dice. Um, so yeah, you've got... This episode and two more episodes before the new rules kick out, kick into high gear. All right, back to your regularly scheduled episode. Okay. So we are in the mission called a team split apart. Go figure. What's going uh, on? A short way down the cramped pathway into the tree, the ground gives way, sending you careening down into the cavern below. As you sit up, you realize that you've been separated. It seems that when the passage cracked open, it spilled the party out in two different spots. Oh. The sounds of monsters can be heard from all directions. Hopefully coming down here wasn't a terrible idea. 
Patrick had better get his act together. Okay, so what do we have? Win conditions. We win when an adventurer ends their turn on the blue exit. Okay. Same as always, we lose when everyone is defeated. And happen. there is an achievement in this board right. called Sickle Slaughter. If an adventurer defeats three of cave sickles in a single turn. That's rough. It would be more possible if Remy had her, her um, eyeball. That extra attack. But in the last episode, we switched it with the mark of marking a strength and forgot that we can't switch it back out in between fights, even though that refreshed. Oh, it does it refresh? Go, yeah, yeah, because it, it's once per encounter. We switched it out and threw it to the thing, and we can't get that back. Yeah, we probably should have just kept it oh, instead of keeping the plus two no. health. Oh, yes, because Remy's our only chance. But I said, if we can get them close enough to her, mm -hmm. and she doesn't have to move, and she's at 5 SP, she's still got fight drive, which is one free fight. Oh, well, remember, Onslaught is three attacks. It could be against three separate people. Yeah. As long as yeah, they're Yeah, so that's each other. the thing. You just yeah. have to be surrounded by them. Okay. We'll is set it possible? We'll set it up. Um, so we still have Patrick, obviously. He gets his heal tokens. He can move two spaces mm -hmm. or move six spaces. He right. can attack and help us. He can heal us. He can us. do a lot. And I think he still goes to the back. Correct. After the initiative cards. Okay. Yes. Um, so we're separated in two different starting zones. We must randomly determine which adventures, except for Patrick, mm -hmm. start on which zone. Okay. The players roll two purples. And the two adventures with the highest are together, and the two with the lowest are together. Do we get to pick what tile they're together on? Yes. Or does it say? Uh, no. The two adventures with the highest are on UM7. Okay. And the lowest are UM5. All right. Okay, then we have something called springy cave sickles. During this encounter, cave sickles are able to jump three spaces instead of two. two. Got it. Okay. Cave sickles, water loa, and an earth loa on the so board. So it looks like we have your favorite, some loot. Uh, Zeke has one damage. And Rook has three. Yeah, Rook has three. Okay, that's it. All right, so I'm going to roll for Nightingale and Zeke. Eight. And let us know we're going to try this again here. Far shot, but you can see the dice. I don't even know if you can see the numbers on the dice, so yeah, it doesn't I, even make sense. I don't know. At least it's easy for us to keep things together. You mean for me to keep them Nightingale together. and Zeke. Oh boy. Eight, eight and three. Eight and three. Okay. Remy's next. Well, okay. well Remy and Zeke Remy are and probably Zeke. going together. And Rook. Uh huh. Yep. So it's Remy and Zeke. And Nightingale and Rook. Which is what I wanted because I wanted... Well, no, I didn't. I wanted a range character and a melee character. That's what we have right now. But Rook shouldn't be with Patrick. Oh, right, because we have the because two heals there. There's we don't no have healer. any heals over there. Yeah. All right. Well, hopefully we can move together quickly. I'm excited. So it looks like this team moves this way. Mm. This team moves up like this. Now, there is oh. an objective token here. Did you read that? I read that right now. Well, the blue objective, how does it trigger? An adventurer adjacent to this token may make an encounter action to make a strength 12 check. Mm -hmm. If they pass, place a passage token on the space. This token occupies. Right, so then we can walk through this. Oh, and meet them. Right. Now, the only problem is... We don't have a lot of strength. I have a four. Nightingale who's over here with the strong person, no, nope. they've got all the strength and they can't really get adjacent to it. I don't know mm -hmm. if this is considered adjacent. Well, I think it is. Uh, actually, no, it's not. It's not. So yeah, only the people from this side could so push it. So strength, strength you can't bump up. Strength is four. So, so we each have 12. four. Yeah. So, so you have, have to roll. Eight to put a passage there. You would have to roll that. Exactly. Yeah, okay. No big deal. Cave, Sickles, Rook, Rem, Zeke, Patrick. Patrick goes at the back. Earth, Water. Oops. Nightingale, like this. Nightingale, Cave. Wow, we got a lot, a lot going on. The good thing is we got the the 
Earth Loa by our magic dealer. So that, that helped out. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I've got, since we have a lot of creatures, they're all off camera. We start with the cave sickles first, and they're going to be moving up onto Rook over here. Four to six? Four to six, yes. yep. Uh, but, 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 no one adjacent. Opponent within range four. Yep, actually, he is already. Okay, so he's going to shoot a ranged attack, and then he's going to move up and attack you there. Are you still immune to poison? Uh, yes, I have my chipped chitin. Nope, that's so not that it. Does. Chipped uh, chitin allows you to block one full attack, right? Um, I... Oh, sickle cell charm. Yeah, so it's not on you right now. Alright, so you no. could be poisoned. So the second attack is the one that can do poison, so... Just, okay, just well, I'm it. not going to dodge the first one then. Alright, so then it's two oranges coming at you. And you have how much defense? 11, I think? 9, 10, 11. Correct. That's miss. a miss. Uh, but then he still moves to be adjacent to you. Okay. And now he attacks. So this could be poison, but it's just two white dice. I'm not going to dodge it. 9. 9. Okay, miss. Uh, then green goes, can it move? One, two, three, one, two, three, four. All right, so he's shooting you. Uh, what did I say? Two oranges minus one, because he's shooting through some friends. Okay. 11, 10, so miss. Oh, yeah, miss. Yeah. Good, 10, and then a move. Four, five, six. Um, now an attack. This is the die now. Um, let's dodge. Okay. Let's oh, dodge. Oh, yeah, you've got the belt. I've got the belt. Yeah, do it up. That's not the right dice. Where's the black? Oh, and remember... Oh, yeah, you got the belt. Okay. Because you've got the ability just to get rid of poison if you need to. I do. Oh, nice. So, 14. Nope. Miss. And then this guy. One, two, three. Shoots from there. Two oranges from range. Okay, these cave wow. sickles are these cave no sickles good. are like they must have studied in Rook's school of combat. <laughs> Alright, now a melee with two oranges. That's the only dodge I have. Okay. Ah, oh, okay. The strongest big attack. Jerk. The strongest attack. Uh it's gonna be a lot. 16, 17, it's 18 damage. So you have eleven defense, so I'm doing seven to you. I think you have one armor, so I'm doing six. First melee attack with the belts, right? Minus two, so we're doing four damage. And can you tap this to do something? Yes, when an adjacent opponent hits you with an attack, they are dealt three physical damage. Or can you just block damage? When you are dealt damage, reduce physical damage, dealt two by two. So you, want, you can do that, or do you want to do three damage to him, or just take two damage? How much damage would I be taking? Four. Let's just take the four. Take the four and do three to him? N I'd be taking four and doing three to him? Or just taking two damage? Uh, let's just take two damage. Okay. Because we're going to go through these. Yeah, really look, quick. we've got three people. we got Patrick down there. Yeah, I know. And then you're going to do damage and you're going to heal. Yeah, and then I'm going to heal. Okay. okay. Actually, well, you're up right now. Okay, well, I'm going to get my men's. Do you have an, another heal token? I do. Okay, so you have three heal tokens? Yes. Okay. All right, let's, let's start this up. Okay, Rook. so I'm going to attack... Smash. What's the first one? Pink? Okay. No, let's do the um, green one. Okay. Because that's the green furthest one. from... Green one. That's the furthest from Nightingale. Do it up. They have eight defense. Starting it up. Fifteen. Okay, he's dead. Green, you said... Smash. Uh, yes, I said green, so, uh... You heal two, I think, and you kill somebody, so... Whenever you can heal two, yes, yeah, so I can exhaust this, and then when you defeat an opponent during your turn, an ally with an SOI heals three. Just heal yourself. Me? Perfect. Okay. Oh, well, you know what? Maybe you could be the one to kill three cave sickles. Because you have blade works for another attack, and then you could always drink your HP potion. Let's see, okay, let's see. So we're gonna do Blade Works. 
Mm -hmm. This is Free rook. Attack. This is rook, remember. Yo, I'm, which one are you doing? I'm going to do blue. Do it. Okay. We've got 12. 12. So you're doing four. Here, five, right? Five. Physical damage. Uh-huh. And a star is six. And that's, he's dead, right? Yep. Okay. So now I'm going to have to... Wow, if this one had three damage on him. No, he's, hey, a... he's at full. He's at full, I know. But, yeah, let's knock it well, out. Well, I right have now. a reroll here. Oh, great. Okay, so and I'm going to spend my HP. Yeah. That HP just gives potion. You an... that so this gives an ally heals within three. It does. I don't think I'll have any. No. And I get an extra SP. All right. Which okay. will spend. Wow, I never thought this was going to happen. Yeah, right? Okay, come on, Rook. Smashes. You just took one. I want to see hammer. another nine. I want to see another nine. Okay. Okay, so, so we're at 12. 12. So you're doing four, five. You need another shield, huh? Yeah, two shields. So you need no. one more point. So I'm going to have to reroll. Five, four, three. Oh, gosh. Okay. Well, you have to get, I guess, the red. Yeah, the red it's, one. And you get a 50 50. Keep the orange. So this is just the regular reroll. This is with my reroll with the Sword of Dominion. Right, let's get this out of the way. What do we got? The same thing, five. Uh, okay, so. I guess you gotta use the ticket. I know, I hate. Or just allows you to reroll dice. Anytime reroll any dice rolled by a figure with an SOI. Hmm. I have to do it. Right? This I is, guess. I have to do it. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Now, picture yourself that you just you just got the Ragnaros's hammer from Molten Core. This is for those of you who are playing Vanilla WoW again. You just got it, and you, you whirlwind on them. Seven. Boom. Dead. Right? Yeah. Got it. Yeah. Excellent job. Thank you. Wow. I'm not playing it again. I just remember those are the glory days. You send cave sickle limbs Who in all like directions. That? Gain oh. one random common relic. Again? Hey. I know. It's money. And that, money. that ticket costs 10 gold. Whoa. So, yeah. This you is my... You buy it again. Mm -hmm. Got the achievement, though. Okay. The Doom Break. Exhaust. At any time, gain one SP. When you use this ability, roll the black die. If the skull is rolled, flip this card. It's pretty good. So that basically just gives me the SP that, that I needed, needed yeah. for. Yeah. yeah. So. Are you going to use it or not use it? No, I'm going to put it. I can't put it up there, right? You'd have to get rid of something. Yeah, the throwing knives. Okay. 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 Well, great job. Because Thanks. Because we can get rid of the cave sickles, and now we don't we don't have to worry about mapping anybody out movement wise. Mm -hmm. Mm hmm. All right. So Rem, you can just go to town. Oh, it's Remy's turn. Oh, okay. okay. Um, move me to the lower. You just want to move here. Yeah. So you can still yeah, because I don't want to be in the water. Okay. Okay. So Remy's gonna attack. Mm -hmm. Ninety. Again, let's go back to WoW for a second. Let's WoW for a second. Who used to play when Vanilla WoW came out? Way back when. Forty man raids, and they were the best. Okay. Uh, nine, which I don't like. So I'm gonna reroll the three with Hammer Helm. Okay. Are these the teal dice? Yeah. Yep, they are. Oh, I got a three again. Forbode. I gotta forbode it. Yeah, do something. Do something, Rem. 
You know what? Rook just showed you up. I know. She was like disoriented. She's like, wait. She heard through the caverns, the walls, that Rook was just killing everything. Now you're done, right? Did I even hit it? No. Nine. Nine. Yeah. You didn't. Oh, you do one damage. Because or you're. Or two. You can do two damage to it. Yes. I can do two damage. Okay. Right, keep that up. Uh, Zeke's gonna. Zeke's gonna go. One, two, three, four. Mm. Five, six. I'm two away, but I don't want to give you the one that gets attacked by the cave sickles. Because I'm not in, um. I'm not. Oh, you've well, got the extra armor. How are the cave armor. sickles going to get there? It's, it's all like red. It's going to go like this. Yeah, oh. they can walk through the wall. Oh. I didn't right. see that. That's okay. That's okay. Watch this. This is how, this is how you shoot things. Cool. 12. 13, 14, 15, pep this, I'm two away, 15, 16, what do you got, 15, 16, 17, 18 damage, 18 minus 9, so 9, 10, 11, it's down to 1. Mm. I did the best I could. What do you mean, you have 2 SP right there. Uh, and I just spent That's what you spent it? Attack. Yeah. Oh, and he's not adjacent to me, or else I can just attack him with the shield. It doesn't have reach one? No. Okay. Darn. Okay, uh, Zeke's done. Earth Loa. You're in charge of the Earth Loa. I think he just Is there an ally within the SOI without barrier? No. no. Is there more than one opponent adjacent? No. no. Can it move and attack an opponent within reach two? No. Otherwise, move towards the nearest opponent. Four movement? Four. It's coming. Okay. Water Loa. I think just cast a spell against you. Is there an opponent within... Is more than one adjacent? No. Is there an opponent with an SOI? Cast a spell six. Prioritizing the opponent with the lowest conviction value. Uh, yeah, casting. Lowest conviction? Uh, I think we're the same, right? Uh, actually, no. I have a teal and a white. Well, then I, I have an orange and a purple, so you're higher than I when am. When opponents are choosing a target, your initiative card is to be at the back of the initiative track. Well, then no. Is I'm it? lower than you are. You have an orange? An orange and a purple. Oh, then yeah, I think it's just... You have orange. a white and a teal. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Uh, so spell six, eight. I think you're going to be good. Eight to block it. I think you got Eight. it. Oh, a seven and a one. Wow. All right. So that's blocked. Remy, we have to add the on. water. Nightingale. I get my three. Um, I'll use my infection to move for free, basically. One, two, three, four, five, six. I don't think I have seven. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six. No, six goes that way. Um, I guess I'm going to have to spend one more SP to move here, and then I will, uh, I'll shoot the Earth Loa with... So you're okay to get attacked? ...my gore shot? Yeah! Okay. You know who this is? Nightingale. Yeah, it's Nightingale. Gore shot, I roll this and that. I get to re-roll. Yes. Right, the sea witch fetish, I believe, when you turn the force of a spell while you're in water. Oh, I have plus one to a roll. I don't think we've ever done that. Mm -mm. Ignore the negative effects of water. Oh, ignore the negative effects of water, terrain, and currents. Oh, so she can dodge in water. Wow. Something I should remember. When making an attack or casting a spell that targets an opponent in power. Oh, I think I only get to reroll. Making an empowered attack while flanking. I can re-roll. So no, this actually hurts me. And I think it's three, three, damage. three damage. I feel like we've done that before. Me too. Whoops. So. No, your character. Well, I don't know. I've I'm definitely kidding, done I'm it, you know, in melee when I flank, I've done it to re-roll, but I don't know. So I get a vow token at least. Uh, and I'm going to cast one more time. Uh, 6, 6, 12, 13. 13 versus his conviction is two whites. Two whites. Eight. Got it. Okay, so two, 
three, and I'll take one irreducible to do two more to him, so five damage. He gets five damage? Nice. That's why I'm casting spells. Okay, 15 more to go. That's why I'm casting spells. Mm, deal two magic damage, you make one. Yep, yep, yep. I'm sorry, how much else does he have? He took. He took five. Uh, all right. He's got I'll, 20 I'll, I'll, keep, I'll keep my vow token. Because uh, I can just throw it all at once. Uh, oh. Oh, you're not yeah. So then the other cave spiders. Sickles. S cave. Sickles. Cave spiders. Cave sickles. Okay. One, two, three, four. I can shoot. It's going to shoot you. Uh, mm -hmm. Through hindering. So it is two oranges. This is a poison or no? No, no poison. Okay, then we'll just. We're not going to dodge this. So you have a 12 defense, right? Because you've got that extra. 9, 10, 11, cool 12. Yes. Miss. Nice. Now he moves. 1, 2, 3, 4. Now he attacks. Um, it's just two whites. Okay. Miss. Oh, he is going to get countered oh. on. Oh. He's going to get countered All on right, right now. Let's see what you can do. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. Uh, 11, still a miss. Miss. Okay. Perp, one, two, no three, four, move and attack range four. One, two, three, four, five, six. Same thing, attack, two oranges, minus one through. Miss, one, two, three, four, five. I'm going to dodge with this because don't I get to counter if the deals no damage? Yep. Okay, yep. so I'm going to use my cloth to dodge. One, One two, plus three. Two, right? Yes. Right, okay. So, it's so I'm at 15. Right. Ooh, 13. Luckily, 13. Miss. So I... You keep it tapped. Keep it tapped, but print. I counter it. Yep. Eleven. Eleven. Eight. Nine. Ten. So three... Four, because the hammer helm. Five, six. Smashed. Because of two shields. Smashed. Same thing. He's going to move there. Attack. Miss. Moves up. Miss. All right. I am Seriously. out of counters. Bring on the competition. I guess I said that last time, and then a lot of guys came, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, remember that? Yeah. Still, so, I'm not sure. We've got more guys okay. probably spawning Patrick's here. Patrick's got to go. I was just saying. Probably okay. have more guys spawning here and guys spawning down there. That's it. Okay. Patrick should heal Patrick. Nightingale. Okay. So let's have him move. One, two, three, four, five, six. Then I'll have him... Um, do a special thing to move two spaces. I'll have him move here. And then spend one heal token to heal an ally three. How's that? Good. I think that's pretty good. Good, because he can't do a range attack, so. I'm just going to keep Patrick at yeah. the back. I like it. I wonder when I do, well, if we do get Patrick shotgun, do we still get to use him? And then will he have like a new attack? Will he have like a, like a... I, screw him, I'm taking a shotgun. What? Patrick's the man. I know, he is the man. He is the man. Mm. Earth. Uh. Okay. Zeke. Okay. Well, Yuck. We'll, well, we'll get rid of the water load before it does anything. Okay. Yeah, but like, I can't counter. I think he just moves, right? One. One, two, three, four. Um, can, what does it say? Move can it move an attack within, within reach two? Yeah. One, two. Yep. Attack Nightingale. Okay. Um, then make a melee attack with reach two. Follow up. Push two and inflict paralyze. Push two? Push two. Inflict melee paralyze. attack is two teal. I dodge any time. Oh, I, can't. I don't have anything to dodge with. No, oh, that's not good. Cats who allows me to re-roll dodges, but I don't have anything. All right, I have 11 defense. They're going to smack me pretty hard. 12. 12. Okay. So it's one, and then every shield. Where does it say that? Down here. 
plus one physical damage. So you do four damage to me. Uh, I reduce two because of the cat suit. So I take two damage. And... Push two and inflict paralyzed force 11. I think I went about three or more damage. I don't think I was ever doing the vow tokens. I only did vow tokens when, like, I failed the spell. But it's whenever she takes three damage, she gets a vow. Oh. Know your character. Apparently, in what is she stronger every time? She should be getting more vow tokens. Okay, now push. Uh, what do I have to do? Two, What's force, it? 11. Force, 11. Okay, well, I, well, I'm really strong, so I get to roll a green. A green and orange, because it's on my board. Oh. You're not well, pushing me anywhere. Or else I would have taken more damage. Yeah. Alright. Earth flow is done. Cave sickles. Um, oh, they're, they're right next to you. I so know. they're going to do some more. This is when they attack. If they do damage, they follow up. They can attack three times each. Ugh. Okay, so I'll dodge the first one. Are you on top? Oh, you had your belt stuck. I, yeah, I didn't use my belt. Okay. Okay. That's okay, awesome. that's none. Uh, 11, 11. Miss. Miss. Okay. Uh, then the next one. Miss. miss. Okay, well, they're done. All I do is just do that. Okay, Zeke. Um, I guess I'll finish off the... The Loa. The Loa. You should shoot her with a thing. Thank you so much. So I'm going to... I have to spend this. Because they were okay. all flipped. Okay. If you don't mind. I don't. And, uh, yeah. Just shoot it. Just shoot him. Twelve. I uh, dead. Only one health left, right? Correct. Alright, so we get two loot cards yeah. from this one. Okay, how's that one? That looks so great. How's this one? A little bit better. Okay. And then I'm going to move. Yeah. So I spend that. One... Oh, really? Hmm. One, two, three. I can just move here. Because I move again, I get a break attack. Oh. So, that's all I'll do. Uh, actually, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll stay there. That's fine. Zeke, Nightingale, Keel one, body suit, get three. Now, do I shoot three times or I do... Shoot him with a big one. All right, I like it. Liquify. Doot, doot, doot. I don't know why oh I rolled gosh. the green. I rolled too many things in that. But uh, I just take three damage. I'm at 10 health and I have a vow token. You mean you've taken 10 damage? Uh, no, 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 I'm sorry. Oh, okay. Where's my vow? Sorry. That's okay. You know, I was I was getting a little... Yeah, ahead of yourself. Getting a little ahead of myself. Yeah. Can't find the vow tokens. Here it is. Uh, shoot. Yeah, I'm down to, I'm down to just ten right now. Six. So if you stay where you are, Rook can move up next to you, heal you, and then he could be the one that gets attacked if they come first next time. Okay. So move up, Rook. So it's Rook's turn, One, yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yep. And he will heal you for six with a men token. Uh, maybe you hold on to it. Why? You could always have Patrick heal me. How much damage do you have? I only have five damage on me. Okay. Keep it in case yeah, we have to go another encounter, then we have more. Okay. Now, do you want to attack this guy? Well, I would have to move up again. Uh, or you tap your sword. Remember, you can move. Oh, uh, yeah. Does it move one space or move a It's diagonal? moved diagonally. Yeah, so you can just go here and get some attacks. And it's going to be really tough, but at least she... It is. Okay, so attack... Red and orange. Red and orange. If he gets five defense. You would have to roll a 14 or more. You have to roll a 13 to do any damage. Well, do, keep your 2 SP and just use Blade Works. Alright. 
right? Yes. Yeah. Get in there. What would you get? Eleven. Oh, that was almost. Uh, Waterloo is dead. And Remy. Oh, okay. Remy gets all three back. Yeah, I'm thinking maybe I should just do Onslaught. Yep. To get them both. Agreed. Okay, so spending three for Onslaught. Oh, sorry. Attack. Why don't you re-roll those? Okay. Yeah. Hammer helmet. Hammer helmet. She's not doing so well. I know. Ten. Okay, so, so it's gonna hit that's him. That's two damage. Three. You're doing three. Start with that because you're gonna get another attack. Right. Three. Okay. So this is my second attack. Mm-hmm. Eleven. Eight. Nine, ten, so that kills that kills orange. Okay. Okay, so now you just have red left. Okay. So that's six health. You still have one full set of rerolls. Yeah, and I haven't used masterwork yet. Okay. Don't need it. See Fifteen. You. Dead. So now I get to pull a card. You do, you do. There you go. Look at that unique. Nine. Definitely need that unique card coming. Okay, uh, Patrick, we'll just have him pop a heal on me for three. Okay. And um, I think that costs, oh, that didn't cost anything. Wow. We'll have a move. One, two, three, four, five. I, I could have him attack. Yeah. Right, I'll try. Sure. I don't know what he uses. Oh, two heals. Yeah, okay. He's realizing that this guy's pretty strong. He needs a shotgun, yeah. He does. Okay, yep. Move around. Okay. Nightingale. Okay. I'm just going to be casting regular spells. Look. Heal okay. um, one. Three Earth. stamina. Zeke. Patrick. Too bad I can't go through him, because then I could... Okay. Flank. Flank, yeah. So we're just going to cast one regular spell. Okay. Yeah. Well, wait. Do you do the um, vows on him? After I attack. Oh, okay. I Sorry, I didn't mean to get you okay. mid... Mid spin-up? Mid, yeah, spin-up. All right, 13 to his two whites. Nine. Okay. Uh, so that is... Uh, I can tap everything, take one damage, to do another five to him. Okay, so he's half health. He's got ten left. Okay. My next spell. That's a lot. That is a lot. Let's see what you get. Nope. Ten. So I can do four damage. You're not going to use a vow? Uh, no, unless I can kill him. Well, how much is... How much does a vow so do? Yes, it does two. Oh, so he has six, six left. left. So no, I have to attack him. Attack okay. him one more time. Okay. I took another damage to do that much. And then the last spell. So Six. 13. 10. Okay, so that is going oh, to... I'm going to take another point of damage. So I do four. So I use one vow to kill him. All right. That worked, right? Yes, it did. Pull that loot. board so we know they're going to be coming back uh, and then I'll use the infection to just get a free move mm -hmm. going one two three four five six okay this guy comes out okay Rook you don't want me to heal you for anything how much damage do you have on you I have four on me you're just going to wait for Patrick to do it that's up to you. Yeah, I'm fine. It's not even your turn. Okay. I don't know what you're doing. That was it. She was the last one to go, wasn't she? No, I, she oh. was the first one in that round. Oh, she was the first one. Mm-hmm. 
Mm -hmm. It was Rook. Yep. Is it like that? Uh, I think it was... He switched? I think Remy, yeah. Okay. So yeah, it wasn't the end of the round. Right. So no monster beginning. has attacked yet. That's why you're asking me. I wanted to heal. I can get one first. Yeah. Okay, well I want you to spawn some monsters is what I need you to do. Okay, so this is Rook. He's going to move. One, two, three, four, yeah. five, six. See you blue. You see the blue. I see blue. Blue totem. Blue totem, yes. A half dozen cave sickles crawl out onto the stone bridge. They screech as they charge at you. Spawn three cave sickles adjacent to the space this totem occupied. At the end of your turn, move the cave sickle initiative card one space up on the initiative track. I'm sorry, what? I yeah. guess that's if there were still cave sickles on the board. Wherever they were, we would have moved them up on the track. Well, now, yeah, now they spawn here. What did it say? It what? said, at the end of your turn, move oh. the cave sickle initiative card up one space oh. on the track. Sure. Well, it's, it goes next anyway. Um, I have I a can't. quick question. Sure. How many is a dozen? Twelve. So a half dozen is six, which this is a quarter dozen. Yeah. Why would they only say? I don't know. It's messed up. I don't know. All right. Um, I don't know what you want to do. Maybe get that loot. Yeah. Can I do it diagonally? Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. okay. Loot. What color? Green. I can't wait for it to pop. Yep, that's the small one. Oh, ten gold and one random consumable. Boom. Look at you, complaining. Always complaining about getting treasure. It's never yeah. bad. It's never bad, except yesterday when... Take it back in here. Yeah, excellent, excellent, That's excellent. Great. That'd be great. Okay. 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 Do you want me to save an arrow? No, I don't want you to save an arrow. Whoa! That's like a, a beeper. Augur's pager. Move any initiative card to the front or back of the initiative track. That's pretty good. Wow, that is really good. Move those cave sickles back. <laughs> They're right. dead. So we're going to have the cave sickles go. Yes. The second mm -hmm. one, I guess, goes like that, but they should get a turn still. Okay. One, two, three. Oh. Yeah, so they're going to move. Basically, they're all going to move, shoot, and then move and attack you again. Yeah. So it's two, two orange. You ready for this attack? We'll leave it there. Um, yeah. Okay. True defense. Doesn't Miss. matter. Miss. Then he moves My defense here. is 11. Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4. This is the poison, but it doesn't matter. Miss. Because he misses. And I have nothing to counter. I'm going to need something to... Oh! Yeah, you could just counter with that. I can spend one... Oh, you minute. need two SP to counter. Shoot. Okay. Search, like this, I can do with just one. Nope. Okay, uh, range attack. 10. 10, no. miss. Melee. Miss. Range. Minus one. Miss. Now, can it move? One, two, three. I think he's going to jump over this to get here instead of getting an attack from you. So I have to roll the pit. Yeah. Nope, he's still alive. Okay, so he gets his attack in. Ooh. Ooh, he hits me. Yep, 13. 13. So 2 damage, 2, 3, 4 damage. Belt does 2. Reduces two. it by 2. And you can tap this to block all of it, so then he doesn't do a follow-up. So he can't poison you. I like it. Everything just blocked it all. Good job. I Rook. like it. Thank you. Star player right now. No. no. He knows cave circles are the only ones he can... Well, he's he protecting Nightingale, that's why. Yeah. He's protecting Night. Uh, Rem? Rem. Okay, Remy gets everything back. She's gonna move. Now, which way do I move? This way. Oh, okay. Can you move me seven, please? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Well, or do you fly. want me to try to fight through the... 
No, I think we'll okay, do then fly. fly, fly, two for two. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Right there. Okay. Okay. Zeke, let me get my three. Spin the one. I don't see the, no, one, I don't. No, you gotta okay. get like here, here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Then I'm gonna spend two more, two more SP to go one, two, three, four. Okay. Okay. Zeke. No, that was just Zeke. Firecracker? Yeah, fi yeah, firecracker. Okay. Patrick. Patrick. Heal her up. Yeah, I guess heal. Um, I'll have him do his free two spaces of movement and then spend a heal token to heal three. I'm... Is she pretty good now? Yeah, she's only down by one. Oh, okay, excellent. And, um, oh, he gets another three. I could just have him move and attack. Sure. Do the orange guy. So let's do that. One, two, three, four, five. If I had a gun, this is what I would be doing. Right. All right, two teal coming in. Oh, he does a ton of damage. Wow, um, dead. I, that guy's dead. 14. Okay, yeah. and I'm assuming if, oh right, I'm not going to kill all of them. Um, I'm going to attack one more time. I've got two more SP. Oh, sure. Right? Why not? Dead. Thanks, Patrick. Oh. He's like, he's like showing up Rook right now. You know what this is like? What is this like? Oh, I this see what's happening. This is just like yeah. the Avengers movie where Thor... Uh -huh. Was in the fat suit, and Andy Dwyer, who's uh -huh. actually what's his name in the movie? Uh huh. Chris Pratt. Star Lord. Star Lord. Yeah. They're on the ship together, and right. they're arguing. Well, they're not arguing. They're both telling each other, "No, that's what this is." No, I know, I know who it is. No, I know who's the captain. No, I. That's what I know. Who. I thought you were gonna say they're trying to like impress Nightingale. Yeah, but they're both trying to be, like, tougher than the other one. And it's oh. like, I'm the captain. Yeah, I know you're the captain. No, you're the... We all know who's captain. Yeah, you're yeah. the captain. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, you're the captain. But like, why don't you fight for it with... with, with yeah, what do you say? With, yeah, it's fight to the death the or something. Yeah, my favorite scene in the whole movie. I can't remember it, but that's paraphrasing. It's, it's basically... You basically nailed it. Right? That's pretty funny. I mean... Thor in a fat suit and Andy Dwyer, it doesn't get funnier than that. Yeah, but guess what? What? Thor wasn't in a fat suit in that scene. You've never seen Thor in a fat suit because you didn't see the latest one. That was just him normal. Or was it in the fat suit? Yeah, you have no idea. But I we just saw watched the latest a one. Clip of it. I All right, saw let's that move movie. on to the next, the next, uh, the next <laughs> round here. Okay. Here we go. We got little knight. Right? Little he was in the bathroom. Yeah. Look, I'm not big I don't remember. Fan. Whatever. It I'm was still funny. Fan. Andy Dwyer's the Nightingale. She's going to move for free. One, two, three. Oh. One, two, three, four, five, six. I don't want to get an attack. Oh, she's like, I'm not going to get an attack on a camp. No. Okay, I don't want to get my clothes dirty. Oh, okay. Uh, and... Um, I guess I'll cast a spell. Cast two spells on this thing. Okay, I'll, I'll just take Fail. some. I'll just take some damage. I'll cast another spell. Okay, seven. What's your conviction? Two purples. Nightingale. No. There you go. The cave sickle that I'm shooting. Oh. Four. Yeah. Okay, so that, I'm just gonna have to do three damage. Uh, one, two. Three damage. Just gonna do two damage to it. Two damage. And then I'll cast a spell one more time. Actually, I'll tap my thing, so I do three to it. Last spell. Ooh, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Two perps. Thirteen. Wow. Okay. So wait, there was three damage on it you did? I did three, yeah. 
It's got three left. Okay. Save. Oh, and now the Keepsicle goes. Well, I guess it attacks yeah. Rook. That's fine. So this is three attacks coming at Rook. Uh, unless he misses any of them. Nine. Mm, oh, miss. That's a miss. That's it. All right, Rem. Start moving, and then you're going to spawn the red. I know. I know. Okay. One. Probably go here. One, two, three. So if something spawns, you can attack it. Red totem. In the corner, you see a cave sickle clawing at an old chest. Spawn one cave sickle adjacent to the token and place a random loot token in the space this token occupied. Oh, uh, well, unfortunately, because we didn't kill the cave sickle. Yeah. We actually spawn the next purple cave sickle down here. You know, because if we killed him before that spawned, we would have gotten another uh, another loot. Uh, but he's a part of the same group. Uh, and a random one. I don't know what color this is. It's there. Alright, well, no more bad guys are spawning. She's going to attack. Okay. Oops. Ten. Let's get a re-roll in let's there. Let's re-roll here. Get that three re-roll. This, this is going to be over real quick. Dead. Dead. Okay. That's Remy. Rook. Uh, Rook, well, he's going to attack. Mm -hmm. So he gets four. Okay. Does anyone need heal? No? Okay. Um... So he's going to spend two to attack the cave sickle with an orange and a red. Rook, gosh. No, re-roll both. Okay. Can you re-roll both? No, one? it's one. All right, just the... He only has three health, so the orange should do it. That's Thirteen. It. Okay, Rook. All right, now, so now someone can is, heal. This is the last combat loot. Someone can heal? Yeah. Uh, how much? Three. Oh, I'm back to full health. Okay, that's the last monster on the board. So here's the last combatant loot. Okay. And then Now we need really, to hurry ourselves out of here. Yeah, really we just need to uh, get the two treasures. So now it's Zeke's turn. That was just Rook. Yep, 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 yep Oh yep, wait, yep. actually Rook didn't move. You can move. Yeah, let's move. One, two, three, four, five, six. How's that? That's fine. I can move two more if you'd like. Yeah. One, two. Okay. So I could be the one that goes through the door. Okay. So we just need to go get the treasures. Okay. So, um, which one do you want? That one or this one? Um, I should probably take the far one, right? Okay. Because it's going to be harder for one, you to get there. One, two, three, four, five, six. Spend another one to move and another one to get the treasure. It is a yellow. Gain one random consumable. Then make a perception 10 check. My perception, ooh, is six. Got it. If you pass, you find a hidden compartment. Ooh. The party gains 20 gold. All right, so we've gained 30 gold so far. Yes. And I get ice arrow, which is going back into the... Shuffle. Plank. Okay, well, you know when hey, we're saved us. in the party. This has saved us. You need the plank. Yeah. Uh, Alright, well, honestly, Patrick? I don't even think we need to do anything. Oh, well, Patrick, he starts each encounter with four. Are you hurt at all? Uh, No, but Zeke is by one. Yeah, but he's all the way over there. So I think what we can do is just... Shuffle up. All Remy you need goes. to do is go here. How many spaces is that? One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, yeah. Get this. Unless it spawns monsters, and then Rook's just going to okay. get us out. It's red. Oh, boy, traps. that's a big one. If it spawns a monster, we get it. Why don't you just read it? No, I take damage. Barrage of darts. Shoot from the chest as you open it. All figures on or within range. Three of the token must make a strength ten check. So it's purple, right? Yeah. My strength is four. I pass. Mm -hmm. Okay, nothing happens. Okay. I would have been dealt magic damage. All right. 
Okay. Um, what happens when we complete this? None. None? No, none happens when we do this? Yeah, no reward. reward but none. what do say we do Continue to Treacherous Rivulet, page oh. 108. Ooh. Which is definitely the next part of the mission. Okay, so we're going to pack this up, probably set up for the next mission, but I think that's going to be the same episode because that was pretty quick. We didn't really do anything. Uh, we need to bank these for when the baby comes. All right, we're gonna you see. want people to have Madara Monday for as long as possible, yeah, right? But, like nothing happened there. Nothing that happened. was pretty epic. We were split up. Yeah, and, and Rook destroyed everything. Yeah, so that was a lot that happened. Rook actually woke up. Hello? That's like a major headline. Alright, well, let's see. We wouldn't tape it now anyway. We would tape it at another time. Tomorrow. So let's at least wrap this up, because if you talk me into saving another week, depending on how long the next one looks, right? Mm -hmm. Looks kind of long so okay maybe maybe you got me maybe you got me so we'll say farewell here thanks a lot for watching let me know if you're playing world of warcraft again maybe uh, maybe you can get me to join and we'll uh we'll see you next time